delivery, and language. Three important aspects of speech. I'm going to speak in turn about each of those. Good evening, fellow Toastmasters and honored guests. Sanji delivered to us a speech about learning from his daughter. Let's talk first about content. What better choice of subject than a story about family, a story about children, and one delivered with such wonderful humor and in such a loving fashion. The content, I think, was absolutely perfect for this contest or for any speech contest or any conversation. It was wonderful. In terms of content, my only area for improvement for Sanji would be in the area of organization. Sanji had a good, strong opening, and he had a good, strong close. But I think speech is made more effective when you tell the audience right up front that you're going to take them on a short journey, and then you hold them by the hand from start to finish. I think the speech could have been made a bit stronger by saying in the opening, and I'm now going to share with you two or three stories about how I learned from my daughter. First, and then second, and then third. Just that one little step, I think, would have made the speech a bit stronger. In terms of delivery, I thought Sanji did a wonderful job. He had lovely open gestures. He was relaxed. He didn't seem to have any nerves. He did uh, a very good job with his vocal variety. His voice reached the audience quite nicely. My only area for development for Sanji in the area of delivery would be, there was just a little bit of hand holding at points during his speech, a little bit of clasping, very, very minor, but it's always something we postmasters like to work on. In terms of language, beautiful use of language, very descriptive, like beads on a necklace, talking about his little Kimberly as a little sponge, the little head popping out of the closet to frighten him. I thought that the, the descriptive language was one of the strong points of the speech. Back to you, Madam Contest Chair.